Okay. Now. Okay. Yeah. All right. Sorry Ooh, about that. Yeah. Ooh, that. Yeah, we got to talk Also, a rip bit. headphone yep. users. Yep. Sorry, headphone users. Thank you, Odd Tricks. You helped us out Thank a you lot. very much. We, we appreciate it a lot. Yeah. I hear you. Yay. Okay. So, too long didn't read. This is the value uh, cube. It's just a bunch of cards I like. This is rare binder. Rare. Yeah, just cards. Um, this like, is some cards. There's some synergy. There's geez. also some things that aren't. Yeah. It's fine. It's. Do you like good cards? Because here are just some good playable no. cards. I don't like good um, cards. And then Winston you've, Draft. You've seen my commander deck. You know me better than that. <laughs> and then what is Winston Draft? Yep. Uh, this is one of the few formats where at, in almost any setting we have to have this at the beginning. Yeah. It's like, because there are people that go to GPs that have never heard of a Winston Draft. Yeah, it, which it's, it's a very interesting draft format and I think really... It's uh, very useful. Yeah, it is. Because it's one of, it's pretty much the only, well, it's not the only... Uh, but it's the only even semi-official uh, draft format that can be played with small numbers of people. It's like, you can draft, do a traditional pack draft with um, with four people, but it gets a little weird. And you really cannot do it with any fewer than four people. No. But Winston Draft, you can obviously do it with as few as two people. Yeah. Um, let's see here. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So a way a Winston Draft works is you get a number of uh, packs. So in this case, 15 uh, random cards from the cube. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. And you make a number of packs that you would need in a normal draft. So, three per person. You then scoop those up. And you will make a stack of them all together. Do you have yours, Carter, or are you still shuffling? I am I was just still kind of shuffling away. Okay. Um, but I will Yeah, I'll take a, go ahead and separate some out. Yeah, might need to shuffle a little more. That was not. There was a distinct lack of a particular color. <laughs> All right. So we're going to be shuffling for a bit. But to yeah. explain the, the Winston cube, the important part is that we... Or the Winston drafting. The important part is that we end up with a pile of 45 times number of player cards. Yeah. So we're going to end up with a pile of 90 cards sitting mm -hmm. right here. The rest are going to go back in the box. We're not using them today. Yep. And the way it works is we take the top three cards off the off of the top of the pile and we form three little piles, just like this. And then when it's your turn to pick, you look at the first pile. And you can either choose to pick that and add it to your pile and you would replace it with a single card or you can pass on it. In which case you put the top card of the deck onto it and look at the next one. If you do that, you repeat this process. If on the third one you choose to pass, you put a card on top of it as normal, and then you take the top card of the library. The rando yeah. pile. And then, yeah, you and just you keep repeat going. This, and when you choose to take a pile, you take the whole pile. Mm -hmm. So if there's more than one card, you take the whole thing. Yep, so whole enchilada. Sometimes that can be good, and you can get, you know, multiple cards. Sometimes that just means that you're picking up some trash with the one card you want, you actually wanted. Mm-hmm. Um, does happen. Yeah, it's like, there's two people, not all the cards are going to get used. Yeah. But that's okay. Also, it's, it, if you go under the idea that a, uh, the packs have an in, even a semi-even distribution of color, and there's only 90 cards... You need 23, uh, 20, yeah, 20, try to get to 23 playables. Yep. Um, you usually end up using almost all the cards you pick, like, ish, and you'll usually end up in, like, three-ish colors. I think yeah. cube uh, is all a the little... cards you, yeah, all the cards you want to take. Yeah. Like, you're going to end up with, 
with yeah. some with some shash. Definitely. But, like sometimes you don't. Though sometimes you. Usually though, you will end up in at least th like two to three colors. Like I don't think you can mono Winston unless you get soups lucky. Yeah, you'd have to get very lucky. I think if you're playing, if you're wincing, the more people you're doing it with, the more likely you are to mm -hmm. be able to do that. Obviously. Yeah. Uh, but it is. You'd still have to get pretty lucky. Yeah. Um, Here. Hand me some of those. Sure. Let's just try and get this pack good and shuffled before I split it. Mm hmm And, yeah. So, we'll... Uh, yeah. I had to reorientate the cube uh, uh, before getting here. So, it was sorted. I think even it was sorted by color and CMC. Oh, okay. <laughs> um... Ish, yeah. So, what? No, I just... I boxed a couple of the cards. This whole thing's boxed. Oh, God. This whole thing is boxed. Well, I feel it's less a, bad, it's, but... It's, it's me cards. They're I all boxed. I know. Because <laughs> um, I don't care. It doesn't change what the cards do. Yes, it does. It does. We're playing by tarot cards rules. <laughs> if the card is upside down, it has the opposite effect. What's the opposite of lifelink? Uh, the opposite of lifelink is whenever it deals damage, you take that much damage. Neat. What's first strike becomes last strike? <laughs> first strike becomes last strike. What does uh, death touch do? Uh, death it, touch clones whatever it hits. No, I think whenever whenever you whenever no, it deals no. damage to a creature, no, death that touch is, is controller. Puts a token onto the battlefield that's a copy of that no, creature. No, Death Touch is any, any damage you take is lethal. Or that. Yeah, that <laughs> works. I don't know how tra you reverse trample. They um, gain that much life instead of trampling over for either, damage. Yeah, either you, they gain that much life or you take the damage. Yeah. It tramples over back onto you. Yeah. No, trample only works while blocking. You block tr damage over. <laughs> Which honestly, I would or love just to see that. Everything on a card. has trample against you. Like what? What would you like? What would rev like the idea of tr you get trample while blocking? Like that's a white green card, right? I yeah, I guess it definitely feels white. Yeah, and it's trample, so I feel like it has to be green. Like maybe white red. I mean, it's not really trample though. Mm. Yeah, but it's... you're dealing combat when this creature blocks any. You may put like this. It's. You just take the you just take the reminder text sure. of uh, trample and you and you just replace it with blocking. Right. No, I got you. So, I, like, I I yeah. got you on what it does, but it doesn't like it's it's not really trample, mm. right? Um, like yeah. I could definitely see it being white red. Yeah, I think that would actually be a really interesting. I think white red commander if it was if it did it like as a lord, mm -hmm. like that would actually be really interesting. I think. Like yeah. a like a Boros Pillow Fort kind of style deck. Yeah, I think you need uh white red or red black in the deck to make that work. Mm -hmm. Because you need something that can make people attack you. Yeah. So I think you need you need I mean, to have red in the deck. Yeah, definitely. Because otherwise it that it that, seems like it, it's kind of a useless ability on a green creature. Yeah, I, I think so. I think yeah, so I think white red would be pretty cool yeah maybe white red mardu. angel that has that ability and maybe, has yeah maybe a mardu or mardu yeah um though i could see that on like a an actual boros angel like just one of the boros war angels yeah and it has an ability that um someone finally has, kicks aurelia to the curb <laughs> it has some version of a of a provoke ability yeah okay let's pull out 45 okay and uh, maybe even just Put that one back. Fifteen. Welcome to Shuffle the Gathering. Okay. And I'm gonna double check my numbers in a second. Okay.
This should be 45. Mm -hmm. Shuffle these in a way where I don't see them. Well, I mean, theoretically, at this point, we shouldn't really need, need to, to shuffle. Okay. Because they should be as as random as they're going to get. Yeah, it, it's going to be a lot harder to get them any more random. Okay, so what I will then do is grab one from here to who and from here to three. Uh, whoever gets the swamp gets to go for uh, gets to go first. the basics um and in case y'all are wondering what these are for uh we'll, we'll see if see. it comes up yeah okay. there's a good chance it won't okay so yeah and also the best way i found this to work is is whoever is looking at the cards is not responsible for putting a card on sure. top so let's see here all right well that was fast okay all right i don't I know this card, but I don't remember what it does. Uh oh, is it in a foreign language? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> I, just, I just need to read it. And it's got a lot of text. I, yeah. Okay. I was about to say I don't own many foreign language cards, but there's a chance one or two made it into the cube. <laughs> like I think I own like four, five, six, seven. You know what? I just think I just don't want to play that card. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm not first picking that interesting and so you also get in like a weird thing like carter knows what this is he knows what but Card i don't know what this is this is um and so if carter sees me take this he knows a color i've picked up i think what's I in the box i think this i don't want to take this card but i think the smart move is to take this card and not take a rando yeah. Okay. I think that this one's probably better. I just don't like this card. Oh, okay. Um, but yeah, so if Phil takes this, I know that either he's in the color of the bottom card, mm -hmm. or that top card was something good for him. It's possible. Hmm. 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 I mean, it's also possible. I think we can do better. Okay. It's also possible that um, I should have uh, taken this Yeah, card. I see why, yeah. Yeah, I'm not first picking that. No, I wouldn't it's, first pick that either. It's not a bad card. Mm. I, the card on top is not a bad card either. Yeah. But, it, yeah, it's just not something I, I inherently want to grab. Yeah, it's like, I would not be upset about picking that. And so if I end up picking this, uh, I'm not going to upset. Uh, oh, wait, no, you don't know what this card is. I do not, because that, that was the pile I picked. That's the card I would have gotten if I didn't pick this. Interesting. Um... You know what? I'm not super feeling that card either. Cool. Well, now I'm good to find out what it was. Yup. And I'm okay with that. I'm not against that. It's not good. a bad card. That's where I want you to be. I want you to be at, I'm okay with that. Yeah, I'm okay with this. So like, I don't want you to be too happy. Uh, this is a card I always want to play, but always end up cutting it. Ooh, F. I think I might have to take this pile. Interesting. Huh. Because of the new card? Or, I guess, the yeah. two new cards? Yeah. Which will be interesting, because one of those cards, chat, is multicolor. Yeah. So, if he's picking it because of that, I have a better idea of why, uh, of the colors that Carter is in. Um. Because I know... Is this just a good idea? I don't think so. It can't so be. So, it's a bit of a niche card, perhaps. Um. But is the multicolor card, and by the multicolor card I mean this card, the second card, uh, good enough? I mean, it's probably good enough, but it forces you pretty hard into a strat. 
I'm, uh, I, th yeah, I think I take this pile. Okay. Ooh, ooh, hmm. Uh, like, yeah, I think I'm gonna grab this. I think it's. Oh, it's, that was fast. It's it's not gas, but it's just kind of something you don't want to leave behind. In worst case scenario, you're now looking at one card. Yes. Like. Like, uh, that's kind of actually one of the great things about taking the the first card. If it's a single card, just take it. If it's in your colors, sometimes it's just worth to grab it because it means that you're not, like, adding more cards to the pile and you're not yeah. giving your opponent a chance to get a card they want alongside something you think you might want. And if it's, especially if it's, like, a good, like, a splashable effect... This is good for me. Yeah, yeah, see? Just taking it. Like, if I had passed over that card, the one you just picked up would have been there alongside this card. Yep. And then I wouldn't have had a chance to come back to this. Oh, wow. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Okay, you're considering. I'm considering. All right. Hmm, are interesting. We gonna, are we going to make things spicy? I think we're going to go on. Ooh, getting spicy. Oh, interesting but not what i'm looking at doing right now okay 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 You've sure seen all right yeah you had seen one of those cards before i'd seen one of those cards and the the card that was there i i think was fine worth picking up so Let's now what do i have here hmm hmm actually but yeah, this is a. Uh, I I really like this format. I think it's a lot of fun. Like, because I find like when I'm drafting with six people, it's hard to remember which pack is which yeah. when it comes back to you, especially in an eight card pack. Because odds are in an eight car, in an eight person draft, by the time a pack gets all the way back to you. It's only going to be left with the stuff that you probably just weren't at all considering. So you can't remember what other things were in it. Yep. Because all the you don't know, oh, you picked it up. Yep, I did. Okay. Because I actually don't know what's what's really in these packs at this point. Ooh, and so... I don't know if I can leave this on the table. It's pretty darn good. Ah, uh, okay. Like, it's the kind of card that makes you think about pivoting a <laughs> little bit. Yeah. It's like... I, um, and, like, we're five cards in. We're not super committed. You're five cards in. Okay, I'm five cards in. <laughs> <laughs> I'm seven um, cards in. <laughs> yeah. Make me happy. Um, so, yeah. I think I'm going to pass it over, though. Because right. it would be a pretty hard pivot. I get to see the gas. Um, hmm, Interesting. Interesting. This is one card. Yes. I still don't... I, I just don't think that's good enough. Ooh. This pile's getting thick. Ooh. This is five cards. Okay, okay. You know what? I'm taking it not only because I think it's a really good pickup, and I think it's worth considering a pivot, but also it's a card Carter would want. Damn it! Um, also, uh, just of the packs I've seen and the things that you've picked up, I know what some of those colors are. Yeah. Whether or not you picked them up for those colors, I. but that is knowledge I have. I know you have those colors. Yeah, no, so that's legit. So taking things that aren't those colors uh, might be a good idea, because maybe that's a color you're not in. Ooh, I think I probably should pick this up. I'm not gonna. Okay. We'll just we'll let that ride. Yeah. I want to see what's in this pile. Okay. I haven't actually looked at anything this pile yet. Or except for the, Like a few. Not many though. Except for it's the been a while. the one that was on the bottom. I've been picking yeah, you're right. the top for a minute. Um And yeah. I don't know. Y'all probably can't tell what those are, but there they are. This is the I'm pretty sure some of y'all can tell what that is. Um, I think I'm not mad about this pickup. Okay. 
So now I get to come back to here and see these things. And I get to see the, the thing that Carter didn't get to see. And I'm considering hate drafting the thing that Carter didn't get to see. No! While picking up a Dees card. Don't do it. Let me see it. Um, I don't know if I can. Um, at the same time, like, I, I don't feel like I can take a turn to hate draft. Because I'm kind of behind on cards, considering how many, compared to you. I mean, I did just pick up five. Oh. Hey there, baby girl. No. No. No, you leave that on the table. I'm picking this fucker up. Damn it. <laughs> I know I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Alright, what ended up in... Oh. Hey. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, right? <laughs> no, the card you didn't see. Oh, okay. Hey there. How you doing? Okay. Chat, I don't know if y'all know what this is. Hey, don't you look. <laughs> uh, Instinct. We're, we're on this plan. Okay. You be on that plan. Yeah. Okay, the card I didn't see, yet, but there, yeah. I mean, the card you saw is, um, is also uh, a thing. I mean, you know what it is, and I know what it is, so Chad can know what it is. It's Day of Judgment. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Four man sorcery. That's we're picking as, this up. That says try again. I don't like this board state. <laughs> I'm considering taking this just because I know you like this card. And also it would be good for this deck. Yeah, that, like that's kind of what I'm trying to figure out. Like I haven't hit a card I feel that screams do this. Which maybe is kind of the downside of a, a value cube with no yeah. halt like hull like Ooh, okay. Yeah, cuz when you have really clear um Signal like signal cards to build yeah, around. Exactly. Yeah, I don't think that's All right. quite my jam. Yeah. Yes, build them up, make those piles grow. Well, fuck. Ooh, I think it's the first rando of the draft. Nope, I've taken a rando before. Oh, okay, I'm not against this card. That's right. Yeah, yeah, you took one early. Yeah, I took one early and I was okay with it. It was a card that I've always wanted to play, but always end up cutting it from Commander decks and Highlander decks. I'm assuming it's not the bottom card. It's not the bottom card. Yeah. I uh, mean, yeah. I mean, I gotta do it. Okay. Is it very you or is it just that good? It's very uh, Lore Seeker. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> um, okay, how do we decide that we were going to do this? We were just going to put them on top, right? Yeah, on top take of that, this? put this on top of the pile, and... Okay, so Lore Seeker is a card that says, add up and pack to the draft. So, so the way that we're going to do this... Is we're going to take the special pack that goes with this cube, that is the Lore Seeker pack, yep. and we're going to put it right on top of here. Yep, and I have to reveal Lore Seeker as I draft it to yep. obtain that effect. So I we're going to put do this it. here, and then, well, yeah, I, uh, yeah, well, uh, it seems like it should be the next card. Okay, yeah. so here, wait, 1, so, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. And then this one will go there. That's fair. And then it's your pick. It's more dramatic this way. Interesting. Okay, I'm, I'm thinking about how this works. If I don't take this, this goes here. Yes. But you're going to see this no matter what. And odds are potentially take it. Because we both know what the pack is. Yes. No matter no matter what you do, I am going to see this card. Yeah. Um, but I may or may not get to see more. So, it, I mean, I guess we can let Chad in on this. Yeah. The pack is 15 Planeswalkers. Yeah. So, most likely, you're going to pick them because they're the most powerful things. So, yeah, I think I have to take this. That that does limit my ability to look at Planeswalkers. Yeah. All right. Hmm. Yeah, 
Yeah. I changed up a few of the Planeswalkers. I don't remember... I don't think you were here for the cube the first time. Um... Oh. Yeah. Yeah, see, that's where it gets interesting. Because <laughs> now this is two Planeswalkers. Yup. Rando Planeswalker. Did it work? Not, Not really. really. <laughs> um, I don't know. I might run it anyway. I'm gonna grab this. Yeah, I have a feeling you would. But there's more. There's more to come. Oh, come on, man! Yeah! Yeah! I'll take that. Okay. I don't care about the other two cards, but that Planeswalker is actually... Damn it! Oh, wow. Okay. I mean, I don't particularly want either of these either. Yeah. Though I do like one of them. Yeah, I know you do. Ooh. This might just be spicy, completely spicy, spicy. wrong. Uh-oh. <gasps> yeah okay i'm in on this okay i don't know what that one is i don't know what That's it is either one. but <laughs> you're looking at it how do you do you not know what it is oh i thought you, yeah oh oh yeah. no that oh one. okay yeah. yeah yeah maybe we just shift on to shift to this plan this is gonna this is gonna be really weird like i don't really know what i'm doing here yeah no this is my plan okay doing that <laughs> Got my favorite ones. Oh, I like you, but I mean, there's yeah. there's one I know you like that you didn't get. Yeah. Oh, you got Arlen Cord, you son of a bitch. Yes, I did. She's with me now. Fine. Well, you know what I got? I got Chandra, who brings the boys. Yeah. <laughs> um. But you got Double Boy. Yeah, I did get the boys. Uh, no, you got the boy. He's the boy that is the boy. <laughs> I got the I, I got the one that brings the boys. Um, I don't know if this is right enough. It's very interesting. I mean, when you looked at it, there was only one, right? Yeah, I know what one of those is. Yeah. Like, but yeah, it's but even with the other one, I don't know if it's enough. I just don't know. Yeah. It's hard. It's really hard. Mm. Um, and I don't know what... And ne neither of us knows what this is. No. Like, are we just doing this instead? I mean, there's nothing that says we can't. I think, yeah, I think that that's... Good, good enough. Backup. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. Right? I don't even know what the second card is. I do. <laughs> I'm thinking. Oh. Because I don't think I can put it back. So yeah, I think I gotta take it just so you don't have it. I don't think I can give you that density yeah. of choice. I think this was a bad idea. <laughs> that goes away. Or, yeah. yeah. Uh, this wasn't a planeswalker anymore. Correct. Okay. And this is what I wanted to see. There okay. we go. That's the that's the walker I was looking for from that pack. Got it. So I believe there's only one more on the table. I, I believe this think is still. I a believe so. Uh, I, I mean, I'm just diving for it. Yeah. Because I think that was correct. I think that's probably like, like that was probably correct. Yeah. yeah. Um. Okay, so I'm probably not going to end up playing the two that I took from you. Oh. Well, I guess I'm taking this pack. Yeah, it's I, I, it was a pretty good pack. Like, I was pretty upset to not take it. Yeah, um, but it's like, it was three I, cards, I, I only I, wanted one of them. But yeah. I wanted the one. Ooh. Interesting. 
Got okay. We're kind of getting pushed towards that chat. Like, then do it. Um, I that's just it. I don't know how pushed we are getting towards it. And Pivot. Maybe... We're only halfway through. No, I think I leave it and continue on. Okay. These are my vaguely playables. How many do I have? Um, no. Jeez. Right. I'm at 22 vaguely playables. I'm okay with this. Huh. Yeah. Like, yeah, I'm not feeling super great about mine. What about you? Like, how are you feeling about your... I'm feeling all right. Things? I'm not feeling great. I feel like I need to take this away from you. But I kind of want to see what else is going on. Ah, but this is actually just good. Yeah. So, here you go. Sure. I mean... Maybe we're pretty deep into that. It's like I have enough vaguely playables that I'm um, feeling all right. I'm gonna because like if I need to, I can make a deck with what I've got right now. Ooh, it would not be it would yeah, not be a I'll great deck. That. I'll take this. I I think I know what I'm. I'm on one of two things at this point, and I'll just bounce between them. I we'll see, we'll think just start this seeing, stays where it is. Yeah, we'll just start seeing what presents more of itself. Uh, that does too. It's a good card, but I don't want to. Yeah, actually, we're looking at this pretty heavily. How does that look at each other? Look together. Um, I mean, not I bad. I don't know that I actually play these cards, but I, I mean, I can. So I think they they get in. Okay, on that. this tells me a bit about what Carter, like uh, kind of what Carter is not on. Yeah, and I'm not really about any of that. Yeah, I I have a feeling that there's more overlap. I'm definitely taking this. Okay, it has a very good card. Um, I don't care about the I don't care about the card. That I think was the card. I guess you saw. Um, yeah, probably. I don't actually remember what was in that pack. Was it oh, multicolor? This, I don't remember. Okay. Um, oh, yes, it was. I remember, okay, I, then yeah. I remember what it was. Let me re-look at this. Um, that's not bad, but I don't have anything in that color yet. I think I know. But, yeah, no, this is playable. At this point, okay. I think I just want options. Interesting. Okay. Ooh. That's a really good card. Jeez. Wow, you end up with nine of the Planeswalkers. Because I just count I only have six. Cool. I think. Go. Okay, that wasn't bad, and it helps us hedge our bets. Oh, no, no, no. I have, I have a couple more that I'm just not running. Yeah. All right, never mind. Wow, this pack has gotten real thick. Yeah. Real thick real fast. Yeah, I probably should have taken it. I think I might be being too picky. It's like, you probably should have taken it. I probably should take it. I don't know. It's, it's got stuff. It certainly has stuff. But it just kind of has stuff. Yeah. Nah, I'm going to give you another run at it. Okay. We're gonna s I think that pot might be too sweet to turn down at this point, though. It might be. Like, at this point, I might just have to take it for density of cards. Yeah. Right? Like, at, at some point, like... I, another card where it just has a lot of text and I forgot what it is. Yeah. Does. Also, I don't know about you, I'm feeling pretty high up the curve. Maybe it's because we just drafted a shit ton of Planeswalkers. Yeah. But I'm feeling really a, a bit higher on the curve than I feel super comfortable oh, with. Oh, yeah. Like, most of my cuts, 
if not all my cuts are going to be like four CMC plus. Yeah. Okay. I don't remember what was in that really. I have vague recollections. It was only one card when you looked at it. I think I actually yeah have to take this based on the card that you, the newest card that you saw and the card that went on top. Yeah. It's I think that's actually kind of what I'll need to. No, it's good. It's a good pack. Yeah. And there was another card in like at least one or two other cards in here I'd considered playing. Hmm. Ooh, I don't know that I can let you have that. I'd consider these. I don't think I'm running this, but I don't know that... Like, it's just a really bad idea for me to let you have this. Maybe I start looking at this? Mm. Always go for the better deck. I don't... Yeah, actually, looking at these colors, I might be in this, because I think you're cutting me on one of the colors I was considering. Uh, we're definitely cutting each other on at least one color. Yeah. Um. So maybe I start looking at this. Hmm. Like, it's not bad. And these are all quite playable. And this has some synergy with some of the other stuff that we're doing. I think I do this. I'm not super happy about that, but I play it. Okay, yeah, that tells me. Yeah, no, it's like... Yeah, okay. It's like, you know I'm not in that color combination. Yep, and I'm, because... I'm 100% in on it now. Yep. I know I have to play it. Yeah. Because... Yeah, you, you can't you, you can't turn down that Dreadbor. Nah, Dreadbor's... Like, and I need it. Especially with the density of Planeswalkers we've seen walking about. Yeah, you know what? I think I take this. Okay. I'm taking a couple single cards... Not mad about him. Uh, oh. I need to... I need to re-look at some of my life choices real quick. And is that worth... doing? Like, can we make that work? that's worth considering i don't know if i can leave both of these on the table but that tells me that carter's not in this like not looking hard at this color he left that on the table yes you're correct so yeah you know a lot of things about my colors right now i'm gonna pass it over though i know less about what colors you're in i mean i know two of them um but I feel like you're in a third color, and I don't know what the third color is. Neither do I. Oh, well that would explain why I haven't been able to figure it out. I know one color isn't. Or at least I'm fairly certain it isn't. Yeah, I, I think I want that card. It's about on the curve where I need to be. Um, right. and if I end up, yeah. Wow, okay, well. Yeah. That pack is just useless cards for me. Awesome. Yep, no, that's. Yeah, like, I think I might need to start you. pivoting into a color that I, I know you're not in. Yeah. Um. And, like, I do have some cards that work with it. Um, I guess I take this. It's not bad. Wow, yeah. Yeah, that, that was a it was a good pack well, for you. Yeah, well, not only that, but the card that you saw, uh, uh, the last card, that the card that you saw get added to it, mm -hmm. and the card that got put on top were both cards um, in colors I needed. Yeah. And the fact that you're not in this opens up some avenues, potentials. You're going you're gonna to be happy with this. Okay. So I might be looking at some just other color Oof. combo. Uh, um, where I'm sure. hitting a brick wall right now is fixing. Um, hmm. I think that's good enough. Like, I'm not happy about it, but I don't think I'm upset by it. I think it's better than a random card at this point. Oh. Yeah. I mean... Yeah. Like, I don't see a world where you put that back down. Yeah. 
Like, I can't pivot yeah, that hard I, this late. No. Like, oh. yeah, I think I have to start looking at this color, depending on what else I get from it. It'll be more of a splash color. Yeah. Because I haven't gotten, like, anything super bomby out of it. Yep. But it's definitely worth considering. Um, I think it, it'll be it'll yeah. be interesting. That goes in. Or we just I'm on a winding road pivoting. I'm grabbing that. I love that one of these cards. Yep. Like I I I I'm at the point where if I had better fixing, I would be building four color, four color good stuff. If I had the fixing for it. Oh. I take this. That's that's the one I take. That's the card I want. Like, Ooh. yes. Excellent. I'm actually very, very happy with that card. Oh, I think I'm grabbing this. I really like this card. Do it. But I'm pretty sure you don't want it. But if I put a card on top of it you want, you'll take it. That's this true. This is three cards thick. I'm going to take it. Fuck it. Because at this point, it's pretty much just, do you see a card you want? Yes. Oh, I want to take this just because I like this card. <laughs> but it's no good in my deck, so yeah. stay there. Yeah, like... Um, like, I definitely have enough cards for a deck. You know what? The The last card on here is... Good enough. Good enough. So, in it goes. Okay, so... Wow, okay. Yeah, I guess we are pivoting this this hard this late. Um. Hmm. This is no good for me, but it's really good for you. I think it might be late enough to hate. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Can yeah. Do what you will. Yeah, I'm gonna hate. I'm gonna be sad. Yeah, because it was a frontier bivouac. Oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Fixing, yeah, yeah. Uh, fixing in at least two of your colors. Um, I I'm gonna look past it because I just I know you're not gonna pick that up. That's fair. That card's really good. Like that's really good. I didn't even get a chance to see what it was. Um. Yeah, like I don't know where I am honestly. Yeah, I'll take that. But I. I'll, I, I think I'm really going to have to consider, look at my colors hard. Like, yes, actually. Um, huh. Like, this is a card that, like, I just can't not... I'm, I think I know, like, because of the pack, Remind I'm going to have to make some... What? With none here. If you leave this, uh -huh. nothing gets put on top, you move yeah. on to the next pile. And, and if you get to here, you have to take this. Yeah, okay. I, no one, none of, none these of us all yeah. have looked at any of these. Yeah, they're so. singles. We have no idea what they are. Um, so I'll take this. Okay. Because it's at least in a color I'm using. I'm going to leave that because I just know I'm not going to be in. All right, so you get that and I get this. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, I got fixing. <laughs> this is exactly what I wanted. Oh, Okay. Yeah, I'm probably not in white or green, which I guess makes me Grixis. Also, this was my windmill slam. Oh, oh. fuck. Oh. I don't right. know if I can use it. I don't know if I can build a deck that will work with it. Oh, you don't know if you have enough creatures? I think I have enough creatures, but they reduce the thing by generic. I don't know if I have enough fixing because I have so many things with double pips. Oh. Yeah, I have a lot of things with double pips, but uh, let me show you my fixing. Yeah, I did not. I got not Sandstep Citadel, a Windmill Slam that, Nomad Outpost, Opulent Palace. Ooh. God, you got all I of also it. got Frontier Bivouac, but I'm not running it. I got, because Frontier Bivouac is a forest that comes into play tapped for me. Yeah, I got... Yeah, that's my fixing. It's not the worst. No, it's not. I, I do have some... It's like, this is my land fixing. I do have some backups. I picked up the Verdant Confluence, which you saw. Yeah. Um, I ended up with a lot of black. I had a couple of other things. Oh, Bloom Tender. I'm definitely in red. 
I think I can pretty coherently say I'm in red. Yeah, I would I would be shocked if you were not in red at this point. But at this point I like I'm looking at like do I just build like red black might just be good enough. Yeah, I'm thinking black green might be good enough um, for what I've got, but I don't I think I really want to do black green white. Like, but the thing is, is, is this enough to be a deck? Let's find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's exactly enough to be a deck. Wow, okay. Well, that was fast. I'm going to need a minute. No, I don't know if this is a good enough deck, though. Is there, is it just good enough to just straight up play? And I mean, it, am I leaving... Am I leaving just too much value on the table? By not including blue? Um, or one of my other colors. Like, I was picking up... I started in white-green. Oh. Um, Which yeah, is... Yeah, my first pick... The one that I wasn't super happy with, but figured was better than a random, was Catacomb Sifter. Ah. Uh, yeah. I mean, it's it's a good value card. And it kind of put me into black green aristocrats. Mm. Which is why I was happy when last pick was Reaper of the Wilds. Yep. Feels completes the whole thing. Mm. I don't know. This might be good enough. Oh, you know what got stuck on top of Day of Judgment? What? Yagmoth's Vile Offering. Oh. <laughs> yup. That's why I was like, okay, I guess I'm picking this pack now. <laughs> it's like, I don't know what else I do. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think so. Yeah. I see where you were fighting me on black. Yeah. I was, hard, I knew I, I was swear. fighting you on black. Yeah. Um, I knew I was going to be, but it like i but yeah like, i was in is, black green is from my black green. like good enough maybe i mean like or is you got a few good black cards because i know because you got a few cards i wanted yeah but yeah i mean like i did end up with like my blue might be good enough um, I don't. I picked up ambitions, cost, and harmonize. Hmm. I found that funny. Um, and if so, is it? But I think I don't run ambitions cost. Blue. Oh, also I picked up treasure map. I don't remember what it flips into. Oh, it flips into something real good. Secretary's draw card. Ooh, that is pretty nice. Yeah. Um. But until then, it just scries. I don't know. Maybe. There. And then... Grabbed a Blade of the Blood Chief. Oof. Oofa doofa. Which, it just says whenever a, a yeah. creature dies. Yeah. A creature. Yeah. Just, whenever a creature dies. Do the thing. You, you want some counters, just have them. Just, you can just have these. It's fine. Um, maybe I do look at Teamer. I mean, like, yeah, what does that's... that look like? But at the same time, like, I feel like I can't ignore a Vampire Hex Mage and a Dread Boar. Yeah. I mean, I don't know how... I'm going to be real with you. I don't know how great Vampire Hex Mage is against this deck. Remove all my counters, kill a Planeswalker. Oh, yeah, that's right, Planeswalker. <laughs> It's it's basically double black dread four. Mm. I always forget that vampire hex mage can just hit any permanent. Yeah. It's like I know that's the way that you use it and the thing that it is for these days, but I mm. just always forget. Yeah. You think it's like, nope, we're gonna reset that hydra or whatever. 
Um, yeah. Well, often just straight up kill a Hydra. Yeah. It doesn't work on, on Man George over here. I mean, it does reset him. Yeah, it doesn't but it doesn't kill, kill him. him. Yeah. No. It will kill um, my, my Planeswalker. But what is fun is that actually with Vampire Hex Mage, if you attack with George... I can block with Vampire Hex Mage, deal two first strike damage to it, and then sack it to remove all of your plus one plus one counters, and then it becomes a one one and dies as a state based effect. That's true. So it does kill Mana George. Under certain conditions. It, it means you can't attack with Mana George. Well, that's true. And if you can't attack with Mana George, then <laughs> Mana George isn't doing much for you. Yeah. Or at least I can't attack with him until I find a way to. To give him evasion. Yeah, or, yeah. I mean, imposing sovereign. Yeah. Because, but apparently, if I, play with this, I just need to be rude. I can't play with... Uh, I think that's yeah. just get out. Yeah, and it's like, okay, if I... And if I want to... But another thing is, if I want to use him of the wild, I basically can't play black. Yeah. I also picked up... Uh, is it Signet because it was stable to something I, I actually wanted? So. I don't remember what yeah, it like was if, attached if to. If I want to use Him of the Wild, I basically can't play Black. Um, um, and I might really need to use Him of the Wild. I end up with three Planeswalkers I can't use Ashiok, uh, Jace Castaway, and Arlen Cord. Oh, yeah? Yeah. They were all just attached to other planeswalkers I wanted. Splash blue. Or no, Arlen Cord was the random one. I got. So I might actually look at Teamer just because it gives me some of my best. Like, yeah. Vraska was the Planeswalker mm. that I was looking for. Ah, uh, yeah. When I said that's the Planeswalker I was looking for. That's the yep. one I wanted to pull. Um, yeah. But I'm it's not sad. mad about uh, Lily, Gideon, or Johnny either. Okay, how many cuts do I need to make? But yeah, I don't think Teamer is deep enough. Unfortunately, if I want to use the him, I right, need to make ten cuts. If treasure cove, if treasure cove tapped for colored mana, I think it would do that. But I think it just is a little. Ooh, slow doesn't quite do enough for what I want, mm. and then I need to cut off some of my top end because I've got too much heavy. Yeah, if I go with if I go with Rakdos, I have exactly enough cards. I don't think I have quite enough cards in any other color combo. Let me know. Let's look at my bricks. 
Francis has to say. George is not part of my plan. I just want more gas. How many humans do I have? This is after necromancer are good enough. Mm. Three, four, five, six. Uh, this actually may end up being my most viable option. Seven. It's actually more than I thought. It's only seventeen cards. Yeah, the problem is, is I just don't quite have enough cards for a three card for a three color deck, uh -huh. actually. Or I can do like Rakdos, but I think watering down Rakdos to try and do him. I I don't have enough creatures for him at the wilds in like three colors. Yeah, that's eighteen. I'm getting close. I only need three more cuts. So yeah, I honestly, yeah, I think just this will be my best deck. Um. Or at the very least, the most consistent. So yeah. I think this is what we're going to be playing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-twenty-four, thirty-twenty-five, thirty-twenty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-twenty-two, thirty-twenty-three, thirty-twenty-four, thirty-twenty-five, thirty-twenty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-twenty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-twelve, thirty-thirteen, thirty-fourteen, thirty-fifteen, thirty-sixteen, thirty-seventeen, thirty-eighteen, thirty-nineteen, thirty-twenty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, thirty-ten, thirty-eleven, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four
All right. Two, three, three, four, three, five, six, uh, we are Winstoning. Three, sorry, we've been five, deep six, in the seven, build eight, mines. Nine, ten. Uh, we are winning Philip's cube. This is a cube that Philip made of his cards. Oh, that's what I did wrong. It's not 13, it's 17. I need two more of each land. Yes, this is my Winston value cube. There we go. That should be enough. Four. Six, seven, eight. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 40, yep. Okay, and let me see real quick. Stuff slash tokens. Let's see what I have. Eight. None of those. Interesting. Okay. So I need 17. I need a little less green than everything else. Okay. Mm Let's see what I can do about finding tokens. Da 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 da. Uh, do you have the basics? Yes, they're right here. Okay. Oh, <laughs> I was like, what are these? Oh, right, my bump in the nights. That doesn't feel like enough. Bumping the nights. Bumping the nights for days. Um, so so many bumping the nights. Six planes. Okay. Four forests. Birds, goblins, Highlander cards. I don't think we care about the monarchy. So yeah, let's see here. So, more Highlander cards. Cards I considered putting in the queue, but didn't. Including, but not limited to, Chandra Torch of Defiance. Uh, th uh, that's me. This is probably too risky, but I'm going to do it that way. Okay. Yeah, I do not have all of the tokens, but that'll be fine. The other tokens I need aren't super permanent. Um, yeah, I think all I need are uh, soldier tokens and zombie tokens. Okay, I got soldier and zombie tokens for days. Well, not really, but I got a couple. I think it's all I need. I think an Eldrazi. Oh, yeah, and the... I have the, the one card that produces old Yeah. 2-2 uh, two, two Black Zombie. 2-2 two, two Black Zombies. 1-1 one, one White Soldiers. The one best one soldier white token. Soldiers. The best Soldier Token. 2-2 two, two Black Zombies. Yeah. And if not, I think one of these boxes Eldrazi over... Scion. I think one of these boxes over here is Chris's thing of tokens. Actually, I think it's that World Waker to box right there. So... Ah, yes. It's either this one or Rise of the Eldrazi. Let's find out. Oh. Um, nope, this is his box of basics. It must be Rise of the Eldrazi. Or was it Scars and Mirrodin? I'm sure it'll be fine. I'm sure we'll... That's definitely not it. Technically, uh, Vraska produces to tokens with her ult, but I don't think we're going to get there. So I don't think it's going to Or matter. if we do, the game's not going to last that much longer. Right. So. 
not this box. Oh, yeah, actually, I think it's that box there. The Scars of Mirrodin behind oh, the TV. sweet. Yoink. Does that feel like it has cards in it? Feels like it has something in it. Definitely has cards in it. They're definitely tokens. Awesome. So, yeah, we'll set that somewhere. Okay, so these are the basic lands. You got your basics? Yes. Groovy. Let me double check, make sure I have... I counted correctly and I have 40 cards. What are these? Oh, those are the basics we used for that. Yeah, I double checked. 40 cards. We'll put some of these tokeny things over there. 15. Oh, right. Here's a bunch of the other tokens. Let's see if any of those were 10. another soldier token. We might get that far. 20. All right. Yes, I have 40. Okay, let's get ready to scrap. Are we gonna brawl? No. Oh. These aren't 60 card singleton standard decks with a commander. Good, because I didn't bring my brawl deck. Yeah. Okay. Ding ding indeed. Uh oh. Highest goes first. I got a two. I'm gonna get one. Damn you it. lied to me. I did. I'd say I'm sorry, but that would also be a lie. <laughs> Okay. Oh, and grab one of those things at D6. We're definitely going to need them. Good call. Yeah, we both have plenty of Planeswalkers. Yep. How many ended up in your deck? I'm running all the ones in my colors, which might actually be a mistake. Three. Three. <laughs> that many SE fans in the deck. 40 planeswalkers, no land. <laughs> uh, also, hello, check the drive. Hey. Joan of Arcadia? Is that Joan of Arc? Joan of Arcadia was a television show. Oh, okay. Um, about a young girl named Joan who started being able to speak to God uh, and was set in a town called Arcadia. It was very silly. Okay. It was not intended to be silly, but it was quite silly. Okay. Um, I I don't hate it, yeah. to be real. Okay. Like, it was fine. It was not a good show, but it was fine. Okay. Sam really hates it. So if you want to hear somebody <laughs> rip into it, just, okay. like, casually bring it up around Sam. Uh, I was going to right? <laughs> oh, oh, no. <laughs> No. Yeah, I can't... Run. I can't do nothing for four turns. <laughs> I can't have only one uh, land and it come into play tapped. <laughs> Pretend that first draw never happened? Sure. Practice draw. I didn't hear it. Practice draw. I didn't see it. Yeah, yeah practice draw. Exactly. Chat, you didn't see shit. We were just testing uh, the, the feel of the cards. Yeah. These are, in fact... Cards. Yeah. Sometimes you just gotta feel up your deck. In sky blue uh, matte dragon. Ooh. I'm gonna shuffle a little better because they okay. were not they were not shuffled as well mm. as I thought they were either. Got it. I'm gonna move these off the table as well. Because God knows I don't have anything to sideboard. I do. I'm playing all but one card in my color. Oh. In my colors. Yeah. I, I, I ended up way too scattered. Man. This is going to be really embarrassing when you kick my ass. <laughs> it is. I am, I am woolying. I am woolying so hard right now. I even started by uh, losing the die roll. <laughs> no, technically, if you are woolying at your hardest, you complain about how you're going to lose and then win the die roll. That is, the, that is, that is how you know you're woolying to the max. I feel like I'm getting hustled right now. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> that, that, yeah. That's that's the second side that you know you're woolying, right? <laughs> Everyone else feels like they're being hustled. Yep. Uh, you guys should both agree to mold four. We didn't turn on Kraken Rod. Uh, oh, I don't know how to do that. You know that. what? We're not going to do it right now. Yeah, we don't know how anyway. Our tech is out sick. He called in sick. Okay, this hand is... Oh, no. That's not right. Keep. Um. Good enough. I really don't think it is. Mine's 
probably actually not all that great re-looking at it, but I'm going to keep it. Um, Technically, YouTube's first. True. Uh, I'm Mulligan. Are we doing friendly mulligans? No. We, we got our friendly mulligans. Okay. We already started with our friendly mulligans. Fair enough. <laughs> we literally started with friendly. First, uh, first hand, my only, my only land was the, the sand step. Mm -hmm. Uh, that hand, six lands. Wolf. Yeah. Let everyone know Philip is a jerk. We already did our friendly mulligans, Gerb. I mean, also, I saw no, we I, didn't. It's not like we I, didn't. That never. That was a practice draw. <laughs> that's we, what a friendly mulligan we, is. We agreed. <laughs> it was for yeah, practice. It's not like I'm keeping a god hand where I'm gonna drop a GT on turn one. I did that in the first game of Highlander. My first game this last Sunday was opening hand, planes, soul ring, GT, Stoneforge Mystic, GT. GTA is one of those cards that's so rude, I feel bad for playing a game that would allow it to exist. <laughs> like, I feel bad for I playing, playing Magic. I was playing against a person who was moderately new to Magic, playing Jund Goblins. You're not nice. I was playing Mardu Hate Bears. I wasn't trying to be nice. I mean, to be fair, that format's not nice. It's a, it, it can be. Like I mean, you, I played like my my uh, match three was against uh, Abzan uh, Pod Val uh, uh, Birthing Pod Value deck. That was some of the best Magic I'd played in a while. I'm not saying that it's not it's not fun yeah. or that it's not good games of Magic. It's just it's not a nice format. You you don't you don't you, be nice in that. Format. You could argue though that the mutual agreement that we're not gonna be nice, like sure. No, yeah, I just is, I'm not saying yeah. that. I, this is not an actual moral judgment. That's fair. Like, to me, like... I'm cause... using nice and mean to describe gameplay. That's fair. Flow. That's fair. Because, like, to me, I think Commander actually ends up with some of the not nicest magic. <laughs> Let Carter multi-eight. <laughs> no. No, he doesn't get to be first and on the draw. <laughs> I mean, you could let me mold a 38. No. Wait. No, that's very yes. good for you. <laughs> <Wait>. <laughs> it's like, that basically guarantees you win. <laughs> alright, alright. Um, Come on, yeah, like, good six. Because I think one of the biggest problems with Commander is the variance good in, enough. in the people that play it. It's a good enough six. I'm going to take my scry. Yeah, I'm going to... Bottom. Okay. And I will play a Planes. Okay. And pass my turn. Okay, that makes me feel a bit better. Um, that makes me feel mountain worse. pass. All right, swamp pass. Um, don't play anything. Don't play anything. Don't play. Damn it! Generator servant. I told you not to play anything. Pass. Um. All right. Feeling worse and worse about my life choices every moment. Mm-hmm. Uh, planes, pay three, attended night. Oh, nice. Pass. Oh, shit, attended night is first strike. Yeah, it does. Man, if I could only read cards. I, neither of us has double red. Isn't Tybalt double red? Oh, shit. Motherfucker going to cast Tybalt. No, I didn't put Tybalt in. If I, I was going to have a pack of Planeswalkers, I would exclude Tybalt and put in uh, Deathrite Shaman. Yeah. Which I can do. I have a Deathrite Shaman now. Deathrite Shaman is the one-man Planeswalker. Yep. Everyone knows. Um, Let's see here. What do I do? I think... Man, Deathrite Shaman would be good in this deck. Mm, mm, mm. You just... Actually, I want you to be a forest. <laughs> <laughs> that would be my preference over a death right shaman at the moment. Hmm. Interesting. Generator servant is too generic. Can oh yeah, it's one in a red. Is that right? Uh, I can actually. You can spend the mana on anything. 
if you spend the mana on Our creatures, creature against they haste. gain haste. Right. Yeah. Okay, cool. I'm going to pass. All right. Swing two. Um, take two. Pass. Well, I accidentally saw one of the cards in your hand. But yeah, I, it was a swamp. Yes, it was. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hmm. And I missed hmm. my fourth line drop, so I don't feel too bad about it. Hmm. Um, yeah, no, don't play cards. Okay, that's better. Um, pass. Ooh, okay. Planes. Okay. <sighs> That's really not what I wanted to see. Mm. Um, we'll swing two. I will take two, go to 16. Pass turn. Exciting magic! You and your five mana. Yeah. Sarkon Dragon Speaker. Oh shit. Okay. Comes in with four. Yep. Um and go make it a dragon. I think. Yeah, I think we're gonna make him a dragon and give him haste. And swing four in the air. Yep. I take four. Yeah. Yeah, that's and so Yeah, pass. I actually got one real quick. Just Sure. I think that yeah. makes it a little more distinct. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah, I was just uh, making sure. I don't know why the camera wouldn't be having it to where our life totals were on the incorrect side, but weirder things have happened with our tech. Okay. So, yeah. Which, so I'm in an interesting kind of spot because I feel like Carter is getting color screwed. Is my best guess. Um. So... Do, yeah, so I'm trying to figure out, like, what do I need to commit to the board? I know he has a board wipe. It, it, there's some... Um, because we, we know a, a decent amount of what's in each other's decks, yes. right? Yeah. Like, we, we didn't take the time to, you know, hide and squirrel away information. Swing three at Sarkon. Um... Two, two, first strike, one, one. Yeah. Uh Hmm I'm going to I'll let him go to two Okay. Opulent Palace. Okay. 
Okay, so now you found your green. Yep. Um, so now I have... Now I have yeah. up to single green and up to double black. Yep. Um, which is relevant because I have double pips in every color. Yeah. Now I have... Like, same, and, like, that's actually... Like, that's really what kept me out of three color. Was I... I, I don't know if it's because Pass. we're not... If it, because the cube is designed to draft to where players will just have a more likability to see um, different uh, different kinds of. I mean, a lot of the cards in it are um, either multicolored or or double pipped in yeah. color. So I think. And a lot of the big exciting cards in Magic are, because yeah. that's like one of the ways uh, to, to kind of curb yeah. them. I'm going to plus one Sarkon yeah. and swing in for four. You got it. I go down to 12. And then... And I just kind of... We're going to Vicious Offering to minus two, minus two, the Attended Knight. Uh, yeah, no response. Okay. And then we're going to pay Red Red for Dragon Whisperer. Okay. Which has, he's Red Red for a 2-2. He has Red to give him Flying until end of turn. He has one and a Red for Fire Breathing, plus one power. Yep. He then has four Red Red, put a 4-4 four four Dragon token onto the battlefield. I can only activate this... If the total power I have on the board is eight or greater, okay, um, which currently it is, yes, until end of turn it it is uh, because Sarkon is a four four. Yes, pass. This is one of my favorite cards from Dragons. I think it, I love its art so much. Uh, I am also now going to start rifling through the token box to see if Chris has any four four dragons. I don't know if I'm going to need them, but I might. Let's see here. I think they're completely alphabetical. Not sorted by color. I don't know. I don't know either. I'm just gonna... No, they look like they're somewhat sorted by color. So if there is a dragon, let me get it somewhere here in red. Soldier, soldier. Let's just grab a big old chunk and see what happens. A lot of goblin tokens. Devil Dragon Token, but not the one I'm looking for. Ooh, I'm going to need some of those Rowdy Boys, possibly at some point tonight. Five Fives. I need four Four Dragons. Uh, yeah, it doesn't look like he does. So, we'll just keep looking. Yeah, I'm in kind of a bad way here. Wait, I saw something that said dragon. Swing one at Sarkon? Um, I'm going to let Sarkon take one. Okay. Because I smell a combat trick. Day of Judgment? Yep. Destroy all creatures? Yep. So what I should have been smelling was a wrath. Yep. And I don't need these turn. dragon tokens anymore, but we might later. Yep. Anyway. Uh, okay. Untap. Oh, that's fun. Land for turn. I have at least a few ways to reanimate creatures from... Your graveyard. Mm. I think I have two, actually. Uh, we're going to just start by plus wanting Sarkon. Yep. BB Bomb a Jeep. Yep. I mean, I'm honestly not sure how I beat Sarkon right now. Because I'm at eight. Done? No. You could have been done. I could have. But I'm not. Pia and Kieran Nalar. 
Oh. Sup, mom and dad's uh, body shop? Aeronaut aeronautic shop? Yeah, sure. I don't know. Two one one Thopter boys. And also, I can pay uh, two and a red to sacrifice an artifact uh, to deal two damage to target. Yep. And I'm done. So, currently, Philip Forest. Currently, with Philip, with having lethal on the board. Yep. Can Carter find a way out of this? Yep. We're just gonna board wipe again. Yep. Magister of Worth. Oh, okay. Uh, what are you voting for? Uh, I vote for the the one that destroys all the creatures. That destroys all uh, all other creatures. Yep. All creatures that aren't Magister of Worth. Hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Counterpoint. I'm gonna vote for to reanimate everything. Neat. Uh, well, the vote is tied, so it destroys all of the creatures. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, no, I love Will of the Council in two player, yep. or as I like to call it, an exercise in futility. I mean, if if I had wanted grace, if I had mm -hmm. wanted to and I yeah, uh, reanimate but, but usually though blowing up the board and leaving you with a 4/4 four -four, is going to be better. It's it's not necessarily going to be better. But it's never going to be bad. Yep. Like, there are very few scenarios in which that is bad. There are scenarios in which reanimating everything is bad. Which it would be for me right now. Yeah. Pass. Four damage. Yes. You could kill Magister of Worth. But it would I cost could. you Sarkon. I could. It's like, so or I you could... think what I'm going to do... Or you could plus and swing, because he's indestructible. Or yeah. he's a dragon. Yeah, and I think getting you to four might be more valuable. Yeah. I mean, I could block, but then I'd so lose Magister of Worth. instead, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna look at... You know what? I'm gonna take a look at my options. All right. Conti, Lord of Luxury. Oh, Jesus. When he enters the battlefield, look at the top four cards of target opponent's library. Yep. Exile one of them face down. Put the rest on the bottom of that library in a random order. For as long as that card remains exiled, you may look at it. You, may, you may cast, cast it, it and, and spend mana as though it were mana of any color. Yep. We're taking this uh, this boy. No, I want that, whatever it is. Oh, too bad. I'll shuffle. Um, yes, and now I know to ask how many cards you have in hand. Fuck. Four. Four. Actually, and I think the answer is going to be to plus one Sarkon. And swing for four. And swing for four. I I have to take it. Yeah, like you I have really to take it and choice. go to four, which is yeah. I think the correct thing. Like yeah. I don't get to kill the Magister, but I'm also now forcing basically forcing you to attack with the Magister yep. and kill Sarkon. Which yep. That's yeah. pretty good. Pass. Um, Plus, you don't know what this is. Correct. Um, uh, that might you, change things. Yeah, like, you are at six mana, though, and you do have a grip of five cards. So, like, you're not... Uh, yeah, no, I'm not out of this. I'm yeah. in a bad position, but I'm definitely not out. Yeah. <laughs> recount the electoral college should be abolished <laughs> i mean it should be but that has nothing to do with this that has nothing to do with the current swaying of this game um mm, mm, mm. Oh, man, i'm so low i need to put i need to put bodies in front of gandhi Let the bodies hit the board. <laughs> Swing forward, Sarkon. Okay. <laughs> Reanimate Sarkon. I do have Yogmoth's Vile Offering in here. Yeah. Oh, shit. If I... 
Man, I have the ma- it's not in my hand. No. I'd be windmill slamming it right now. No, because you need a legendary. It's a legendary sorcery. Oh, right. You need a legendary creature on the board. Or a planeswalker. Or a planeswalker. Which... I don't know, Carter. I don't know if either of us have any planeswalkers that we are running. <laughs> um, I don't have a planeswalker that's hit in the field this turn. But I am paying six for Captain of the Watch. Ooh. That's three soldier boys? Yes. They three one one soldiers, uh, who are currently two twos with vigilance. Nice. Because Captain of the Watch gives them each plus one plus one and vigilance. Nice. Pass. Interesting. 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 What you got? I haven't decided yet. Absent legendary deck with Urza's with Urza's ruinous blast. Ganta and Ganti into ruinous blast. Ugh. I mean, Ruin. how? Are, yeah, like, but how do you? I guess you're just casting them in that order, but like, I I would think it'd be pretty interesting to steal someone's Urza's ruinous blast with Gonti. But oh, I figured that's what he was. Saying. No, 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 because like the I, because you could Gonti and steal somebody's Urza, Urza's ruinous blast and then cast it. Yeah, curve wise. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But I was just saying because if he's running them in the same deck, like you can't Gonti your own library. No, but you but, can Gonti yeah. somebody else's. Sure, sure, sure. And or, well. I don't know. I don't know if versus is super common, but and you yeah. know it sees some play. Um, I'm going to pay three. You can pay seven for it. Two radiant flames oh, for two fuck. damage. Uh. Goodbye, soldier boys. Yep, yeah, you got it. Everything has two damage marked on it. Yep. Um, swing for two. This feels like a trap, but I'll try to make that trade. Okay. And this is still nope. exiled and still yeah. face down. Yes, but I still get to cast it. It's as long as that card remains Oh, exiled. seriously? Oh, yeah. fuck. Yeah, yeah. Gonti also, Gonti's coming back with minus one power. Uh, rude. Yeah. I have definitely bullied. Rude. So rude. Bloom Tinder. Fuck! <laughs> I ta- We're junned now, boys! All Actually, right. we're, right, we're- Technically, we are junned. But I, I only tapped for Golgari. Yes. Pass. I mean, the correct play was to reanimate Pe- uh, Pia and Kirin. Yes. But this was way more fun. It's definitely way more rude. Um... Planes. You don't even know what this is. No, I don't. Like, even reanimating the Captain of the Watch was arguably better than reanimating Gonti, but double Gonti is very rude. Mm. Delicious. Swing four. Uh, take four. Go to twelve. So yeah, we got ourselves a. I mean, I'm I'm gonna show this to show this to chat though. Go 
those colors do not work out. Damn it. Um, okay. No, because then I don't. Hmm. So it feels like Carter's got himself in a bit, bit of a pickle. P -p -p pickle. Yep. I need that planes to be any other land. Mm, 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 mm. So he either has triple black or double green. I can double green. Triple green or triple black. I have neither of those things. Then I don't know why you didn't want that plane to be any other land. Because I need to play two things. Oh. He needs to play a double green and a single green. Or probably more likely a double black and a single black is the more likely. Or a black and green and a black and a green. That's true. Oh, yeah, double Golgari. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or double green and double black. Yeah. All of those would... Point is, you don't got enough of it. Yeah. Yeah. More Which, again, stuff. might be a problem. Like, with the cube, there's just more color fixing because it runs each enemy signet, it runs all ten tri-lands, and it runs uh, the bu the buddy lands cycle. Yeah. Or at least the ally color buddy land cycle. Um, and then there's some other fixing. There's, uh, Ash Barons. There's some, the typical green you fixing. I'm gonna take a risk. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. Can I? Can you? No, I can't. <laughs> no, I almost can. But I... Oh, wait. Yes, I can. Cool. Aha! Alright. Nissa World Waker. Uh-oh. It's not as exciting as you think it is. Yeah. Uh, because I'm going to plus one Nissa World Waker to untap up to four forests to untap one forest. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> For Golgari Germination? No. Oh, okay. Catacomb Sifter. Oh. When he enters the battlefield, you get an Eldrazi token. Eldrazi token. Sure. Okay. Pass. Oh, cute. This is not the play I wanted to make, but it's an efficient use of mana, so... Sure, sure. Um... That's true. If you're stealing Blast, yeah. it means they have a Legends deck. Uh, Torin Mauler. Uh, yep. Whenever you cast... A spell. Yep. You get a plus one, plus one counter. Yep, 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 yep. Say hello to Chad, everybody! Fuck! Damn it, I needed him. And... Let's see here. What's this plus two again? Uh, all creatures uh, must... Uh, all creatures target opponent control must attack Chad if able. Neat. So, Magister of Worth is dying? Uh, I'm, I'm considering forcing you to attack him. I'm considering him. Yeah. Because... Um, not a bad play. Yeah. And... But... I think, yeah, maybe... I think, actually... Oh, wait. I always forget that her plus one that turns a land into a creature does not end at end of turn. It doesn't. Yeah, it's it's bizarre, and it, I always forget. Yeah, it doesn't, and it's really good. Um, at the same time, I think yeah, maybe killing the Magister of Worth is worth a dump bunch. Yeah, I mean it's good. Um, at the same time, I think I am actually going to force all creatures just uh during target opponent's next turn, creatures that player controls attack Gideon Jura if able. Yep. So yeah. Which is great, because it doesn't mean these creatures. It means at the beginning of his combat step, any creatures able to attack Gideon must attack Gideon. So if I make a land into a creature... In your main phase one. Yep. Yeah. And then... 
Um. Uh. I think I'm going to Swing. attack you for one. Attack it's you a for one. one? Yeah, attack attack you with a one two death touch. Yep. You have two red mana untapped. Yep. Is it one two or one three? It's a. One, three. Oh yeah, I'm sorry, a one three. Okay. Uh, cards in hand. One. No blocks. Okay. I go to three. And then I'm gonna pass. All right. Ourselves, uh, God, this is still game one. It's been a pretty good game so far. You know what's really shitty is that this isn't even enough to kill Gideon. Nope. This is a. Uh, I mean, this is a one-one. So yeah, you're That's one seven. short. Yep. You could always make a four-four land. I could. Do I just die? I think the answer is no. I think I don't just die if I do that. But I don't think that's a I don't know. I don't I don't think that's a good idea. Whatever, I'm doing it. Okay. I still don't think it's a good idea, but I'm doing it. Go for it. Black black. And two. Okay. Sell the score, targeting Torin Mauler. Yep. Uh, yep. You can put a counter oh. on it if you like. Oh no. Alright. Oh no. Two counters on Nissa Worldbreaker? Yup. Uh, she can't ult yet. Not yet. But you also haven't used her yet. True. Um, so. Now that Torin Mauler was pretty integral for me to win. Yes. I'm going to plus one her. And this plane is, is now a 4 4. Is now a 4 4. Okay. Swing out at Chad. Swing at Gideon. Take it. Uh, kill your Gideon. Yep. And the shitty thing is, I'm tapped down. Uh, pass. If you have one point of damage in hand, I lose. And what's if you, her minus seven again? Her minus seven is I get mm -hmm. uh, four. Oh, a number of basic land cards, put them onto mm -hmm. the battlefield. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And they become four. You got me. Really? I had two land in hand. I could only deal two damage to you. You could deal two damage to Nessa. Oh, yeah. But then you just kill me on, like, you end that, you just then will end up killing me on the crackback because you'll swing at me for eight and then you'll have a four, four flyer. So unless this. True. Though you could deal one, you could have dealt one damage to. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't have. Yeah. Oh well. Sorry. I yeah. I. I tried to give you a chance to walk it back. Nope. Oh well. Also, we need to get more games. <laughs> we need more games. Yep. So yeah. All right. And that's to... why you don't scoop. That's why you always play it out. Because yep. either a you're not actually dead, or b they make a mistake. It's true. Yeah, I uh, yeah, you know, you're right. I just co totally could have swung one at Nissa. Yep. It's like cuz all you really needed to do was stop her from ulting. Right. Like I had I had a good board state. I was in a good position. Yeah. But, but I didn't it was when I drew the land that I thought it I couldn't win. Yeah. Cuz I had drawn actually What was the other card in your hand? A land. Oh, I had two, two lands. Land. Yeah, oh, I had wow. drawn I had drawn a land like 3 turns in a row. Wow, rough. Yeah. But yeah, when I was staring at my hand trying to do math, it was because I had, uh, I had Nissa who's double green. Mm -hmm. I had Cell Scores, which is double black. Yep. Catacomb Sifter, which is black green, and Reaper of the Wilds, which is black green. And I had uh, one forest, one swamp, and yep. one 
Uh, yeah. But oh yeah, those board wipes, like the that back and forth board wipe was actually pretty hot. <laughs> yeah, and the, I'm pleased with the number of wipes in this deck. Mm-hmm. Uh that was all both of them. <laughs> and uh, apparently my incidental ones. Like just I like just just enough to deal enough damage to some of your things. Oh well yeah. 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 I mean radiant flames. Yeah. I'm actually now just considering splashing a one other non basic just to have the uh, the chance to get it up to three. Yeah. But, I mean, oh well. I n there's enough double uh, double pips in my deck even between two colors. Yeah. That like a lot of the time like I and if get... you steal my fucking bloom tinder again, <laughs> you can get green mana off of that. Yeah. God, he's so fucking rude. God, he's the fucking rudest. I love him. I meant to be play I meant to play him in Highlander. Mm. Um, last Sunday, but I just uh, forgot to move him from the cube in the deck. Um, yeah, I was pretty happy with my um, deck I played. I didn't do very well. I think I got like, I think we had eight. Yeah, we had eight people. I think I got six, but I had a lot of fun. Yeah. Um, Ada's necrotic ooze combo deck just beat the tar out of me. And you beat. Two other people, that's not bad. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, I just... Ugh, her Necrotic Ooze combo is so rude. Because it's just so many tutors. And then, yeah. And lots of uh, transmute for threes. I assume you're going first? Yes. Yeah. Oof. Um... I definitely shouldn't keep this hand. I'm not keeping mine. Go to six. Uh, ah, what the hell? I'm off a game. That means I can keep a bad hand, right? Yeah, that's exactly right. how that works. Yep. It means you can keep a risky hand. Yep, I'm keeping it. As late as we are, if uh, you win this one, we might end this on a tie. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Which, it's nice to end on ties. Everybody wins. I'll reset our life totals. Thanks. Yeah, I can't keep that. Ow. That's rough, buddy. Highlander Mulligans? No. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yeah, a one land hand with a two drop, but then just two six drops. Rough. Yeah. Like the scry but um, I'm not actually no, I'm not on the draw, so actually yeah, that just straight up wasn't keepable. Yeah, I mean this hand's probably not keepable even on the draw. Uh I can't actually cast anything that's in the hand with the lands that are in the hand. Whoops. What? It's fine. It's fine. I'll just shuffle that into here. It'll be okay. Sure. It's like I'd rather have it in my hand, but it's fine. I, don't, I refuse to go to four. <laughs> okay. Leave it on top. All right. So it was a land on top then. Pass. I could have had a uh, a handful of, with four lands and a and a spell. It's true. I'd have kept it, but <laughs> <laughs> I, I I would have been okay keeping that. But okay, but yeah, mountain. All right. Huh. Sure. Planes. Souls attendant. Boo. Pass. Um, Swamp, pass. Swamp? Okay. Swing for one. Take one. Go to 19. Pass turn. Pass. Oh! Oh, I felt that in my soul. Yep. On Ow. the bright side, we're probably not going to uh, 
uh, in late on a uh, on a on a tie. I don't I don't think so. Attendant night response. Okay. Enters the battlefield. Enters the battlefield. Trigger on the stack. Triggers uh, on the stack. Yeah, okay. Soul attendant trigger on stack. Attendant knight trigger on the stack. Disfigure the um, knight. So. Okay. So I still get the. Yeah, you're one still. One. Yeah, you're still gonna gain the two life, but that's the more important creature to kill because it's True. gonna kill me faster. Yes. And swing uh, one. Yeah. I go to eighteen. I go to twenty-two. My turn. Yes. Okay. Because at least then I get to play this. That's, yeah, that's a good card. Yeah. And I, this doesn't die, because... And I gain one life ago, 23. Yeah. Uh, yeah, because it's not my control. It's a regular soul sister. Yup. But it is a May, so you do actually have to remember. Alright, done? Yeah. I love that card. I love soul sisters. Well, Phil, this might feel familiar. Okay. Hey, Chad. Settle the score? Oh, okay. <laughs> that kind of familiar. I don't have a... Because that's what I did yeah. to the Torrin Waller last game. Also, I don't have enough mana for Chad. Sure. Swing two. Take two, go to 16. Pass turn. Wouldn't be the first time I've died to two one ones. <laughs> uh, in a pre-release one time, I Pass. nearly... I nearly won a game off of a single Carpoose and Wolverine. Wow. Swing two? Uh, take two. Pass turn. Um, let's go ahead and lightning strike the soul's attendant. You got it. Lava Born Muse. At the beginning of each opponent's upkeep, if that player has two or fewer cards in hand, Lava Born Muse deals three damage to that player. All right. Pass. Beginning the of my upkeep, I do not have two or fewer cards. In hand. Yep. Yeah, Lava Born Muse, the red muse of that cycle. Yep. Um, and I found this in a in a uh, fifty cent rare bin. I love it. Nice. I think it's great. Ailey? Yup. Pass turn. Okay. Got nothing else I can do. Daunty. You son of a bitch. I need this! Because you realize odds are I'm going to end up taking a land, right? Uh, y if you take a land, you can do nothing with it. Oh, it's cast? You may cast. Ugh. This is bullshit. Gonti has found his limit! Then I'm taking this. Fair. Pass. Yeah, okay. I'm surprised you didn't swing. You have a 2-3 death touch. Yeah, I'm not gonna trade Ailey for your Lava Born News. Mm -hmm. Fair. Doesn't do anything immediately. Hmm. Sand step sill. Okay. Pass turn. That unlocked the ability for me to play the other cards in my hand. Got it. Um. Combat? Yep. Um, block the 3-3. Three, three. Okay. Pay one. Sack the 3-3. Three, three. Gain one. Take two. Okay. Lose one overall. Sure. Land. Go. Toy two. Yeah. Yeah, Gerb, thanks for that. This. But yeah, ugh, if only I, I could have, like, I think yeah. I, I don't know if I would have or not, honestly. I think I still made the correct call. Uh, 
I feel like you've got a trap. I feel like this has got to be a trap. Five. Did you? Cool. Uh, minus two Gideon, destroy Gandhi. Sure thing. Swing two. Uh, take two. Go to 12. Pass turn. is Gonti's card. Yes. Okay. Um I think I think what we're going to do is cast Zealous Conscripts. Oh fuck. And gain control of Gideon. Target permanence. Yeah, you got it. Uh, m minus two. Destroy Ailey. Destroy Ailey. Yeah, you got it. Swing for six. I take six. Looks like we're ending on a tie after all. Go sixteen. Okay. End of turn. You get your kids back. Yeah. There's Chad. O G Ch yeah. Chad. Pass. Yep. Yeah. I thought you were just going to deal him three. I was, going to, I was going to swing him at you and then sack him for life. <laughs> I had a plan. I mean, you can still sack him for life. No, I can't. Oh, zero him. And then, okay. And then sacrifice him to Ivy. Yeah. Okay, interesting. I mean, I can't sack him for I can minus two him to kill one of your creatures. Yeah. Which I might do. Oh, no. I was saying use his zero... Mm -hmm. Swing with him. And then sack him to Eile. That's yeah. what I said I was oh, going oh, to do. Oh, okay, that sorry. That was the plan I said. Oh, okay. Yeah, eile has got to get out of here. Yeah. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, no, yeah, you got plenty of cards. <laughs> yes. Lava board views. <laughs> yeah, I, like, I got to realize, like, he's net Like, with his mana base, he's never going to get that low. I might. But lava I just love lava board views so much. And it's a three, four mana, three, three. It's a, it's a what, what is that? Hill Giant? I think. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, it's a hill giant. Completely playable. Zero Gideon. Okay. Yup, he's a six six. Swing six. Uh take six and go to six. Pay five. Uh oh. Liliana. Ooh. Um comes in with five. I can plus one to make a zombie and mill myself two, or I can minus three to get back a creature from my graveyard as a zombie. Don't think. From your graveyard? Yeah, from my graveyard. Okay. Unfortunately. Um, so I think I want to plus her here. Okay, to mill two and get a zombie. Get a zombie and a mill a forest and a weak dancer. Oh, okay. Pass turn. Okay. Untap. Neat. Land. Fuck. I don't like the amount of mana you just. Blame Blade Angel. 
Oh, shit. What does she do again? Whenever a source deals damage to me or a permanent I control, Flamed Angel deals one damage to that to that source's controller. Yeah. So whenever... I can no longer redirect that to Planeswalkers. Yes. All right. Um, you swinging in? I'm thinking. Yeah, I gotta swing both of these at Gideon. At Gideon? Yeah. If I don't kill Gideon, I'm gonna die to a 6-6. Six, six. Yeah, no, I think that's the right call. Yeah, I'll let that go through. Pass. I need to remember that I have this card, so I'm going to set it here. <laughs> like, it didn't change what my play was, I don't think. Right, yeah. It may have changed it a little bit, but not much. Mm. I, I think this is still a solid line. What can I get back from my graveyard? I mean, Eilie. <laughs> yeah. But she, honestly, I don't know that she does that much for me right at this moment. Yeah. Uh, she would give me away a game life, which is nice. Hmm. Because also if I minus three Lily, you just kill it with Flame Blade. And there is anything I can do about that. So I don't think anything in here is worth losing Liliana over right now. Okay. So... Swinging is pointless. This is really rough. All right, well, we'll plus one Lily. Get another zombie. Yep, and mill two. Mill two. Uh, mill planes. planes. And? A Nomad Outpost. Mill a couple lands, okay. Yeah. Um, then I will... Uh, green and black for Bloom Tender. Okay. And black... Double white for Zathrib. Yup. Okay. Uh, he's the, currently the only human... On the board. On my side of the board. Yeah. And only cares about my side of the board. Okay. Pass. On tap. Draw. Combat? Yep. Four at Lily. Okay. Six at you. Six at me? Yeah. Um. Let's. I'm, I can't do anything about this, so I'm not going to. We will. Double block here. Okay. And Alright, Lily would take four, we take three. 
Okay. Or, or declare no uh, marks. Okay, yeah. And then when the damage happens, uh, trigger, trigger. Yep. You'll take two. Yep. So five. you'll take five total. Yep. Uh, this dies. Yep. Take five, go to 11. Yep. And Lily takes four, taking her to three. Yep. Um, main phase two. Chandra Flame Caller. Oh shit! We're, oh right, I knocked all my dice over. Um, I'm going to use her X, her minus X, to deal two damage to each creature. Yep, you got it. Uh, killing both of yours and none of mine. Yep, and I get a zombie. Yeah, because he counts himself. Yes. Forgot he counted himself. Whenever Zathra Necromancer or another human. Yep. Forgot he counted himself. Damn it. Okay. I should have just played Chandra and plus one. Um, yep, that is, play a land for turn, pass, sure. Yeah, darn, I forgot, I forgot he replaced himself, at the very least. That's my, that's my fault. Yep. Um, because yeah, now I'm actually forced. not that, in that much better of a position than I was. I love this angel. Oh, swing two two zombie at Chandra. Okay, trigger. You take one. Yep, I take one. I go to ten. And then we see Magister of Worth. I would like. I choose condemnation. I choose resurrection. Uh, resurrection is not a legal option. What's a legal? You can choose grace or condemnation. I would like grace, please. Uh, well, the vote is tied, so mm -hmm. condemnation. You fucker. <laughs> I had to. Yeah, no. <laughs> like, yeah, I, no, I, I totally <laughs> agree. Um, My turn? Yep. Oh, no. Oh. I'm sorry. Activate no. Lily. I <laughs> make a 2 2. Yeah. Make a new zombie. Uh, swamp and Frasca. Yeah! Damn. Oh, well. I, I, there's still one card in here that can get Braska back. Yogmoth's Vile Offering is... Cast your Catacomb Sifter. <laughs> okay, you got it. Pass. Alright. Now the question is, can it kill you? I'm pretty sure you can. Um, uh, there are not many... Not right this second, I can't. Yeah. Uh, but there are not many top decks that get me out of this game. Yep. Well, I'm going to swing at you for four. Um, yeah, I take four and go to two. And... Haley is the only thing in here worth resurrecting, I think. Um, no, maybe not. No, I think that's what we're doing. Minus three Lily. Okay. Resurrect Ailey. Okay. She is a white, black, black core cleric zombie. Nice. And then pay six, leaving Step Citadel untapped. Sure. For Captain Blotch. Okay. Yeah, I don't. Yeah, okay. I know now. Yeah, I now. I can no I, longer have a. I think I have a way to get out of this. It might have. I'm not sure if it wasn't the right call to have picked the soul's attendant there. Actually. Mm. Okay. For my turn though. After life. that. Yes. Okay, I'm sacking this to scry one. Yep, you got. It. You also have a mana. Yeah, I do. Putting this on the bottom because it doesn't help me win. I don't know what helps me win at this point. Oh, this was one of the things that was going to keep me up, like, that it's what I kind of want now if I if you hadn't hit me for four last turn. Oh. Go ahead and do it. Yeah, we are. Radiant Flames for two. Oh. Very sad. Yeah, I mean, it... It kills a lot. It kills a lot, but I'm still super dead, Carter. 
<laughs> yeah, no. If you, uh, before the captain of the watch, uh, what I wanted was Sarkon. In response, I, I BM you by sacrificing the zombie for to gain two life. <laughs> yeah, what I really wanted was Sarkon, and then you played the captain of the watch, and then I didn't want Sarkon anymore. <laughs> but yeah. Yep. Oh, that was... Oh, a, man. That was, there was some... Top card was Yogmoth. Your deck just had a lot more synergy than mine did, I think. Yeah. I, turns out... Um, I had a lot more... Like, I had some decent answers to your stuff. Yeah. Like, like I... You had some good stuff. Oh, yeah. I was about to say, oh, well, wait, 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 they're all going back in the same place. Um, so, yeah. Let's uh, start pulling out the basics. Oh, yeah. Which cool. I... Felt, I felt, again, like I got flooded but maybe maybe that's just huh. my perception i don't know i think you just also had a lot more stuff that felt like it affected the board state whereas i, I felt like i had less stuff that affected the board state um i actually just also just actually probably wasn't running enough bodies to be like kind of honest like um like i was playing a more of a controlly deck like yeah, actually, this was pretty controlly. Yeah. I think I think we also saw all of the the really sweet stuff in my deck. Yeah, um, I, I think like I had a Johnny Bone Picker, mm -hmm. um, yeah. Imposing Sovereign. I think were the yeah. only like sweet things. We Coligon, had seen. Dragon Lord Coligon was one of the things nice. I didn't see that I really would have liked to have seen. Um, that's about it, actually. Um, for GG stuff. GG indeed. Yeah. Like, um, consume the meek would have been nice a couple of times when you were going a bit wider. Mm, like, yeah, that just nom noms. Curse of uh, disturbance. Oh yeah, consume the meek uh, would have absolutely wrecked me at several points mm -hmm. in both those games. Yeah, but yeah, I don't know why I put all the basics back there. Okay, yeah, all my basics. Such a basic. Uh, they should be all my basics. I'm gonna so check. basic you can fetch for me with an evolving wilds. Okay, uh, where are the lands? These are the lands, those are the lands. So, yeah. Uh, lands. Let me pull it, I'll pull it all up. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, this is my Swamp. cube, except for this. This is Highlander, and this. This is tokens and stuff I pulled out of Highlander. And Bump in the Night. I would actually wouldn't be surprised if... Oh, those are more <laughs> basics. There's a lot of Bump in the Night in here, okay? <laughs> yeah, like, Bump in the Nights. We got your Bump in the Nights. I still think you need to take the the bump in the nights and and plaster them onto the sides of a wooden cube so you can have a bump cube. I mean, I need a only <gasps> couple what? Better yet. All right. You need a sheet of bump in the nights. Okay. I'm listening. And then you need to take a silhouetted uh, Mercator projection. Mhm. Mm and then Oh, here they are. And then use that as a mask to overlay on top of the, mm -hmm. the Bump of the Knights. Yeah. And then you have a bump map. Ha. Huh. <laughs> it's perfection. But yeah. I, I have a lot of Bump of the Knights. I need more Bump of the Knights. I don't have enough Bump of the Knights. And Gigabytes won't sell me all their Bump of the Knights. <laughs> and Card Kingdom only lets you buy 20 at a time. That's a lot. Yeah, but and also... It's only, I think, yeah, it's only been printed in OG Innistrad. So, which means, like, so for cards, like, I'm trying to think of some cards that have been reprinted a bunch. So, like, okay, like Lightning Bolt. Yeah. Lightning Bolt, that's been printed a lot, right? I will take a look at your upload when I get home, group. I assume he's talking about the uh, Facebook oh, Magic yeah, yeah, the yeah. Designing group. Probably. Um, probably. Um... I don't know why I'm Where was I? This. Oh, so like Lightning Bolt. So like Card Kingdom will let you order up to 20, or if they have less than that of a card, of it, any individual printing. So because there have only been one printing of Bump in the Nights, I can only make one Bump in the Night order per order. Right. But if there were more printings of it, I could do up to 20 of each one. So, yeah. Oh, well. Such is my life. Yeah. I. Uh Getting oh, I'll sort the planeswalkers out later. Getting four of the trilands was yeah. definitely Yeah. Um oh I can go ahead and sort out at least those three. Okay. And this one. 
Yeah, there should but be yeah. four more in there. Yeah, which I think I just saw them here, some of them here. Oh no, those were the lands. I'll I'll like rearrange it. Oh yeah, there's your girl. She wasn't in. Oh yeah. Yeah. Jessica is great. Yep, she's awesome. Let's see. It's this direction. Who are magic? Build a bear. Yep. Um. But yep. So yeah, this was uh. Uh, Mike, it was fun. I, yeah. Those were some pretty good games. Yeah, those were decent. You, yeah. you kind of got screwed a couple of times. But... Yeah, I also made some like suboptimal plays in game one for sure, sure. For, for the lols. I will. I just wanted to gaunt you again. Bitch, <laughs> so rude. <laughs> it's so rude. You know what else is really rude? Blightings in the cube. It's the rudest card in Magic. Uh, Rich right. Mind, which is. For all of his purposes in this cube, basically, um, him to Turok is also... Yeah, yeah. I should put a him to Turok in the cube. No. Yes. No. Yes. It's so... No. Yes. No, why would you do that? Because it's awesome. But yeah, uh, so that was... That's it for this week. Monday, we'll be back with more Curse of Strahd. Um, AKA try to not kick Philip out of the party. Or try to kick Philip out of the party. It really depends on who you are. <laughs> From Phil's perspective, it's desperately trying not to get kicked out of the party. In my head, we're not a party. <laughs> I don't know you people. I've known you for nine days. No, That's not that long. No, so, I mean, it's over a week. Yeah, like, but still. And you've spent, like, all of your time with them. Like, eh. all of it. Yeah, they're very ungrateful. I've literally carried every single person in our party out of a death house. While they were unconscious, at one point or another, I even carried the body of a, another player, but they're not. That character is dead, so I guess that doesn't count. <laughs> but I, for every, I have pulled four different characters unconscious slash dead bodies from a death house. So if you want to see Phil carrying unconscious bodies, <laughs> must come and watch Curse of Strahd, where I literally have carried the party. And Tuesday will be story time with Sam and Katherine. Yeah. So that'll be fun. Yep, yep, yep. So Monday and Tuesday, you can get your weekly dose of Sam. Yeah. All right. Yes, it's in two days, but it's like a super concentrate of Sam. I mean, it's six solid hours of Sam. Sam, made from concentrate. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night, everyone. Do you have the mouse? Because I don't have the mouse. I have the mouse. Okay, let's, yeah, we got it, we got it. I yeah. mean, I could end it at any time, I just haven't. Oh, okay.